Hello everyone. In the previous video, we installed Laravel UI package and now the time is to uh, create two type of dashboard. So let's go here and uh, let me open the web.php file and uh, show you that how routes are working. So by default, there is a welcome route, which is slash. Okay. And then there is a auth route. So this is responsible for login, register, logout and stuff like that. Okay, so it comes with the Laravel UI package and this one is responsible for opening this dashboard, right? So now the time is to customize this uh, dashboard. So how we can do this? So this is uh, coming from this home controller. So let's go to the home controller and yes, it's sending this home page. So this home page is located where? So it's located in this views and in the views there is a home blade right so we are opening this home blade so you are logged in it's printing here so now we are going to uh, make uh, a separation like uh, uh, we are going to make the separate dashboard of the user and uh, separate for the administrator so i'm going to move uh, i'm not going to move this so let me copy all of the stuff and uh, i'm going to this uh, auth and here i'm going to create a uh, home dot blade dot PHP file. Okay, so I'm making this separate for administrator. Okay, hit enter and here paste everything here. So you are logged in as administrator, right? So if the user is logged in as administrator, so we are going to print this. And if the user is not administrator, we are going to print this. You are logged in as, as simple, we are logged in as user, right? So logged in, okay, logged in. So I spell this in, okay. Save this one and now the time is to build our logic, okay. So we are in the home controller. So let's go to the, let me wait for a moment. Okay, so I'm going to uh, create it uh, separate okay make this uh, auth slash home okay so this one is the uh, index and uh, here i'm also adding this auth dot home right so this is uh, for administrator and uh, i'm copying this and pasting it here so this is uh, user slash home so it's for user and this one is a uh, home controller so let me make this also a user and create a user controller so how you can make the user controller separate? So I will show you in a minute. So here you need to type php artisan make controller. So we are going to create new controller. And uh, here we are going to uh, create a user controller. So we are going to make the separation of controllers like we are separating the users controllers and administrator. So I'm going to create a user controller. That's why I'm creating a first user folder. And then inside the folder, I'm going to create the controller. So what is the name of the controller? So I'm going to uh, make this home controller, home controller. Okay, controller and hit enter. So it will uh, create the directory inside the controller and inside the directory. So let's go to the app, HTTP, controllers and in the controller it's, it's created this uh, user directory and in the user it's created this home directory so we created this one right so let's go here and add a method of index which is responsible for opening the dashboard user dashboard okay so let's go here and return a view so view name is what is the view name so we are going to not open this auth home we are going to make this user home so how we can make this uh, user in a separate in the resources so let's go here so this is outside of the directory so let's create a user directory user and then move this directory inside this user great i uh, accept this and here you need to type when you type user so it will suggest you to user dot home so it's mean that I'm pointing this one, this one home. Okay, so you can also click it on look into this blade, right? So now our two blades are ready, two dashboards are ready. How we can authenticate that to, uh, 
uh, use uh, where the user will be land on this dashboard or this so how we can validate this so i will tell you that in the next video so next video is going very amazing so i will meet you in the next one bye bye